Well, the interesting thing about our time, and particularly in the uh, late 20th and into the 21st century, is that we're discovering how much about the universe we don't know, that it's a far more complex, huge place, a complex place that we in science thought we were pretty smart about, which we really aren't. That is the challenge of today's world, not only at the larger scale, the scale of the universe, as are there complexities that we don't know. They're finding more and more complexities within ourselves and at the way the body works and the way the subatomic matter works, that the, uh, there are just many, many opportunities for young people that are curious to uh, find a niche for themselves to study, 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 and perhaps invent new uh, technologies and new uh, methods of understanding things that we simply don't know. And now we think we're pretty smart here in the late, uh, late 20th and early 21st century, but we still have a long ways to go to understand ourselves and the universe at work. The, the uh, challenges of understanding and science are open to you and technologies, new technologies are being invented all the time. The real problem, however, is that right now our uh, evolution and our discoveries, we have put ourselves in a very untenable position and that our lifestyle is not sustainable the way we're doing it. So we're going to have to learn to be better ecologists than we have been in the past. To do what I'm talking about, you do have to be innovative, you have to be creative, and discover new ways of thinking of things that have not been thought about before. That's what innovation is all about. And that is what the creative mind is all about. And the intuitive mind is to discover new approaches to the very problems we have to solve that we haven't even thought about solving at this point. But uh, we have to first think about solving them and then thinking about how do we go about that. And that's our new field, totally new fields of endeavor that are just now opening up and it's up to the young people uh, to learn how to do that at this point.